can you imagine a world where people that suffered from a heart attack actually get better? A world where there are these patients no longer die uh, due to this infarction years after uh, the myocardial infarction. Um, so, uh, uh, mm. Yeah, I know, sorry. So, what, what happens in a myocardial infarction is that you get an occlusion of a, an artery, and this artery is occlu... Uh, uh, so, actually, my slides don't work. Okay, you get an occlusion of a coronary artery, and this a part of the heart dies, and this part of the heart is, cannot regenerate itself. So a scar tissue is formed, and scar tissue is very rigid, so the heart doesn't function anymore as well as, as it did. So this leads to heart failure, and heart failure is one of the most devastating diseases in the, in the world, affecting at least 100 million people worldwide, which is enormous. So in the last couple of years, people thought, well, stem cells could be the solution to this problem, which uh, was already introduced by the, the brilliant scientists already today. So I'm not going to have to explain this. But stem cells can become every, every other cell in the human body, so they can also become heart cells. Unfortunately, when these stem cells were injected into patients, it didn't work. And the major problem with this was that not enough stem cells reached and attached to the damaged area of the, of the heart. So what we did at the VMC, people worked with microbubbles and ultrasound. And microbubbles and ultrasound are sm small gas-filled bubbles which you can deliver specifically at any place of the, of the human body you want. So we took these two techniques together to form our new technique, and this is called a stem bell. And a stem bell is a stem cell that, stem, stem cell that we couple to all these little gas-filled microbubbles to target them specifically to the right place in the heart, to increase the number of cells specifically at the right place. And this is an actual image of such a stem bell. This is so cool. This is a cell covered with all these little uh, micro bubbles. So it, we can create these stem bells. Another problem when you inject cells is that most of the cells pass through the middle of the bloodstream, where the flow is the highest. Of, uh, so they never come in contact with the cells where they need to attach. Luckily, our stem bells, you can push them via ultrasound. It looks like this. So you can push them from the middle of the bloodstream to the vessel wall, where they can really attach at the right place. So this is also really cool. So uh, in a recent study we performed, we injected uh, stem bells. And what we found was that we found an eight-fold increase in the number of cells, specifically at the right place in the heart, which is an enormous increase in the number of cells that we found. So we were really happy about that. So now we have more cells in the, at the right place, but this, does this also lead to uh, a better functioning heart? And actually, it does. The stem bell technique works. We get a 70% reduction of uh, the damaged area, which is an enormous reduction. So it really works perfectly. So we were uh, really happy about this. So I can not only imagine a world where people don't suffer after a heart attack anymore, I can help create such a world. And Unfortunately, to create such a world, uh, we need to de further develop our uh, technique. We need to get them available for patients, and we need to do that for in clinical trials. So, unfortunately, these clinical trials are really, really expensive. So, uh, we have the key to success, but unfortunately, no one so far is backing us up with, with money. So, what we hope here uh, at the TEDx Award uh, that someone will help us uh, bring this idea to patients. So I cannot imagine that this beautiful product is going to be put on the shelf because no, there's no funding now. Uh, so we can't get it working without some help. So what I need is one brave pioneer to help me with the, getting this uh, product into the patients. And I hope that in the with this TEDx uh, program, I get one of those, such, such a bright guy to help me with it. Or female, I don't, I, I actually like females. <laughs> but... <laughs> so please uh, pick us up and help us to get this, uh, this uh, into the clinic so it works. Thank you. Thanks. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations.
again. This is going to be a photo opportunity. Of course. Wave to the audience. Good night.